C.J. Abrams had committed to Alabama, but it does not appear he will ever set foot on campus. A shortstop, very athletic, only 18 years old, but he is one of the big names expected to go early tonight. He spoke to uh, Cody Chapin, spoke to C.J. Abrams just moments ago. We are in Roswell at Taco Mac with Blessed Trinity shortstop C.J. Abrams as we are counting down to the Major League Baseball draft at the top of the hour. C.J. projected to go maybe top five tonight. How are you feeling right now? I mean, I'm excited. I'm excited to see what happens, uh, share this experience with all these people behind me. Um, I have a lot of supporters, and I'm thankful. You're a guy who was invited to go up to the MLB studios and be a part of all that. Why'd you want to stay here? I mean, like I said, there's a lot of people around uh, me and my family, family and friends. I just wanted to share the experience with them. Who are all these people that are that are here today? Do you know everybody here? I know pretty much everybody here, yeah. There's baseball team, friends and family. Very cool. So the Blessed Trinity people are representing. I was looking at your scouting report. Everybody talks about your speed. What are you going to bring to a, to a big league club? I'm going to bring hard work and a good teammate who loves to win. And what other parts of your game do you feel like you can work on and develop once you get drafted? I mean, I, can, I feel like I can work on every part of my game, but um, getting faster, just every part of the game, I feel like I can get better. That out. Chris uh, is joining us. Tell us uh, what it's been like, to this whole process of getting him ready to be drafted. Uh, it's been a wild ride from the moments of uh, when he was 18 months old to this moment now, which is pretty crazy with all these people here, but we, I, I've enjoyed every minute of it. It's been a labor of love, and if I had to do it again, I wouldn't change a thing. Talk about that 18 months. It really started for him that early, getting him ready for this point in his life, huh? Yes, it did. I put a baseball bat in his hand when he was 18 months old. Uh, I'm sure both parents got the same big old pink bat with the ball. And, you know, I started throwing him balls, and he was pretty much on time. He was ripping them throughout the house at 18 months. And mom... Baseball mom spent a lot of time at ballparks, driving to practices, doing all those things. Is this when it all seems worth it? Yes, it, it definitely does. This is it. We're so exciting. What's it been like for watching him kind of grow into this player and this young man that he's become? It's been wonderful. I, I knew he could do it. I knew this day would come. I'm so proud. So as you start to look, do you, do you try and figure out maybe what team it's going to be or any of that stuff, or are you just kind of letting this process play out? I'm kind of letting it play out. You know, I'm just enjoying it, and it'll all take care of itself. And, you know, you still have a chance. He is committed to Alabama. doesn't have to go pro if you don't want to. But if you do go pro, it's going to start in a minor league somewhere riding a bus. Are you excited about all of that part and kind of starting from the bottom again? Yeah, starting from the bottom. You know, this is just the beginning. It's exciting. It's just the beginning. The hard work starts after this. All right. It's going to be a fun night. You've got teammates and family and friends all here. Can't wait to see where CJ gets drafted. We'll talk to you and have more from him after he's drafted coming up tonight on Fox 5 News at 10. Ken, back to you.